Hi guys, today we're gonna bring in a new person at our house who will be the next member of our family. So, we're going to make its, what do you call it, home. And also, do you know what it is? Tell me! Well, probably we'll just give you a hint and then you can see. So, um, I'll take you all through the journey. We're gonna go buy it too. So we need to go to the pet store. So follow me, let's go make it home. Now do you guess what it is? Yes, it's a fish! That's correct. Now we're gonna set up its home. We did everything since we had fish before. Um, okay, so let's just tell you the four elements about this. It's home. It's home. Yes, the tank. So the first thing are these two babies, or this one too. Um, their natural effects. That's like one thing that a fish needs, or else it'll be like, what is this? Some chemical factory? Um, and then the next one is a temperature, you know, measuring thingy. Thermometer. Yes, and a filter and a heater. Okay. So, so that, like, it's really cold. That's why um, we have to keep a heater so that the fish don't get um, cold. <laughs> um, and like the uh, uh, that thing, the thermometer, um, tells you if the water is too hot for a fish or okay for a fish. And then the filter, last of all, if some, you know, some dust comes in or something, just like... Or the fish poop. Yes. Then it will go in and there's a brush inside that'll make it hook on. And then um, soon we also have to clean the filter. Okay. So you added the plant. When did you add the plant, Sora? Probably uh, last year? Right? Yeah, last year. So did it grow any leaves? Yes! I mean, there was like only these two then, but now there's a lot more, including that stem that's gonna grow a leaf. Mm -hmm. Wow, plant, mm -hmm. wow! You're a grandmother now. So, now what do we need to do? Oh, and plus, you guys, did you know one thing? This rock was only one rock once and then it turned into two rocks <laughs> <laughs> no <laughs> just kidding there's only uh, two i know you're confused if like a rock turned a, a rock <laughs> i mean i don't even know if rocks are real of course they're not real because they mo don't move or do anything at least plants don't move, but they um, need to eat and drink water to grow, grow. Rocks don't even grow. They just, if they're formed as, pretend this was some type of rock, they don't stay like that forever and ever and ever and ever. So what, uh, what do we need to do next? We need to make sure the water is good. Yes, so we're going to use this thing, which is a fresh water master test kit mm -hmm. to check like if there's any bad stuff in there. Mm -hmm. So what are you going to check? Oh, we're going to check this thing. Uh, you, uh, ammonia. Mm -hmm. Ammonia, I think. What you need to check, Sarah, first. So the uh, fish pH test solution. Yeah. And then like the pH test range test solution, I think. So you need to check the pH and then you need to check the ammonia. That's it. And uh, wait, and I need to show you other things that we've got. Uh -huh. So. Come on. See, these are some few things. Oh, come down because I don't think I can hold a lot of things at once. Come on down. So there is this. 
which I can only explain when I explain this and this. Okay, so this, first of all, it's a water conditioner to yes to mm. make the water safe for the fishies. Mm -hmm. That is there. Oh, and talking about safe for the fishies. That's a medicine. I know, medicine. Oh wait a second. It says Appy. Appy. I guess we're using the same brand. Um, it would be a surprise if this was. Oh, it's just top. That's the place where we got these things. Medicine. Oh, and this, this, this is the pipe that we put it in there, and then like my dad had to, or else there's no other way. He sucked this so that um, the water goes down in there, and then like whenever that's full, you have to transfer it to this, throw that away, um, and throw it like this, and then go like this. So that's just a use. Okay, so that's for uh, water changing, right? Stuff. Okay, are you ready to go and get the fish? No. Nope. Not yet? No. What do you want to do? Peach. How? Oh. We're gone already? Yeah, I, so I don't remember that much, Sora. Help me, I'm getting old. Mm -hmm. Here we go. Okay. Here it is. Freshwater master test kit. Mm -hmm. Okay, what am I supposed to do? What does it contain? What does the kit contain? What does the kit contain, Sora? Oh, it contains a few testing things mm -hmm. and these chemical bottles that will help test. Okay. So, what we're supposed to do is... Why am I speaking in a bad accent? So, I have this thing. It's from Appy 2, I guess. Oh, pop the lid open. Get it How much you need to take, Sarah? 5 ml. Oh. Yeah. levels that um, like a, uh, a lot of the fish love like seven uh, freshwater pH thing um, so what is the normal waters pH do you think seven so we just have to keep it like this if it's seven let's check the pH will it be seven or more or less because like if you put it less, it turns to acid, which is bad for fish. And if you turn it a little to up, it'll turn into base, which is also bad for fish. So let's just open this thing. Hope our thing is closer to seven, right? Uh -huh. I mean, we don't have the thing they said for the recommended pH levels. They said that we have to use something called a pH adjuster. One, two, three. Okay. That's enough. So what are you gonna do now? Oops, wrong one. <laughs> Close this. Close it or else it will break. I meant not break. You scared me, pH level thing. Switch, switch. Switch, switch, switch. Yes. Let me put that in there. Now what we need to do is that we need to mix it up. That's what it says here at least. Flip it around, that's enough. Yep. Okay, let's wait for it to settle. Okay, it's fizzing a bit. What color is this? What color do you think it is? See it? I don't know. Let's check this. This is the thing. Left it up. 
recorded. So do you see? We need to see. Um, which one do you think it looks like? Which one is it? Because I think I know. Seven point six. Yeah, it's it's on the high range. So probably we need to get a pH adjuster from the pet shop. Pet shop. Yeah. So we'll get that too. Mm -hmm. uh, now we need to wash this, so excuse me for a second. So I already put some water in it. Now it's time to test the ammonia. I remember that the bottle one was this color, so this is like a scavenger hunt for them. Mm -hmm. You are correct! Bottle one. What am I supposed to do with it? Where is it? Bottle one. Why is this for ammonia? Okay, I got it. And um, it's. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Eight drops of. Ammonia test solution one. Oh, okay. Okay. I got it. Eight drops. You guys, count with me so I don't get wrong. And the fish level is um, lesser than what we think. Sarah, keep it away from your body. Okay. Keep it on the floor. One, two, three. Four, five, six, seven, eight. Hmm. Oh, what do you have to do next? Oh, we have to you know what we have to do. We have to close up this lid. Read again what you have to do. It only says holding the dropper bottle upside down in a completely vertical position to assure uniformity of drops. What is the next step? Is add eight drops from ammonia test solution to mm -hmm. holding the Get it, bottle. get it, get it, get it. Not in this. In the same. What? Yes, both the solution need to be added. Wow, that is cool. To close, the lid. close the lid properly. Mm -hmm. Don't drop it, it's chemical. Be careful. Mm -hmm. Can you close it for me? Swell, swell, swell. Yep, I'm correct. Be careful, it's chemical. Mm -hmm. Ooh, it looks white. Whole there. Eight of them again at 16 drops of ammonia. Now what do you have to do? Close the lid of this, of course. Mm, then? Then, put it in the box. Close this up. Sugar tight. Don't. Just flip it around. Do you have to read again the instructions? Or you have to do something more. No. One, two, shake it. One, two, three, four, five. Okay. Mm. What's the color? It'll perfectly fine. How much Zero is it? Zero ppm. Okay. Zero ppm ammonia. So that means it's active. No, there is no, there is no ammonia. That. What does that mean? There is no ammonia inside that. That's good. I'll go wash this one too. And wash my hands. Mm -hmm. And then we'll go off to buying the fish. Okay. Hi guys. So we're going in the car right now. Has you seen us? So you know that we're in the car. Here's the mask. I don't know why I'm showing you. But I'm showing you. And um. Um, like I, I don't know which fish we're going to buy. I 
just don't know. What do you think? Which fish do you want us to buy? Um, maybe an angel fish. Or, um, no. I remember the angel fish was something you ate. PH. Um, what was that? What? what? Neon Tetra. We'll, we'll get the Neon Tetra. Or maybe the fighter. I don't know. I just know so many names of it. Of fish. Like, not so many. Just like a few. Neon Tetra, fighter, um. Yeah, that's, that's basically So right now we're at Pet Smart and we're about to go inside and buy the fish. So we found, found the um, type of fish we wanted. The betas, the fighters. So let's try um, finding one that is like. Parakeets? Yep. What are the other things? Oh, what is that? A guinea pig? That looks like there's a guinea pig in 
Oh, it's a guinea pig? That needs two red stickers. Yeah, it's a guinea pig. Yeah, it's a guinea pig. So you guys were back home and look at the cute little fish in there. I took a bath as you see my clothes are changed. So now we're gonna transfer the fish in here. Um, when we test the thing, it was too much for the fish. So we bought this new thing. It's called top fin pH decrease. So we have to pour it in the water a little bit and then it will decrease the things. Um, one time um, it turned, it was still 7.6, but then it finally turned into like 7.2 or 7.0 and that was perfectly fine for the fish. So we're now gonna make it stand. How am I gonna do it? I don't know. Let me ask my friend. So first you have to dip this inside the water so that the temperature maintains, okay? Okay, so we are not transferring that? it. So we're going to just put yeah. it in so that the temperature maintains. Mm -hmm. Put it not on the plant so that the plant Leave it there. Yeah. does not get hurt. The fish is probably like... <laughs> yourself so you can look at her and decide if you want blue fin or, no um, black fin or blue scale or if you like you can do another name we will check which one's the best for her and we will make her name so I I may just may Take like a name tag, no, not, not a lay, name tag, like a sticky note. I would write the name on it, like I would write name, and then I'm gonna make it, um, make it, uh, the thing. And I think it's called a crowfish. A crowfish. We have taken the lid off, so we'll see if like the fish tries to sneak out. I want to try to like keep it down a little bit so that the fish can swim, but it's not sinking. Let's just push it down a bit. Leave it for her. It's fine now. Definitely fine now. Haha, <laughs> wow. Awesome sauce. It floated to the down. Now let's pull it out. Pull that thing. Wait, 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 wait. Let's let it go. It's go. It's gone. It's in. It's out. Will it just climb? Hello! Fish! That way. That way. That way's the greenery. That way's the greenery. That way's where you... S okay, it's definitely interested in the heater and it's reflection over there. Let's go! Yes! Meet the plants. Meet the plants. Yeah, there. It's definitely more active in the plants. Like, it's definitely going in the plants before, like, the fish never went in the plants. Ever. Oh, look at that. Any minute now, it should start sucking the rock. Because that's what all fish do. Suck the rock. Oh. Yeah, it's going in the fish favorite saw spot. I named it. Because every fish, whenever they come in, they're like, I'm a wrist right there. It feels super cool. 
What is that thing? What is it? What do you think it is? Is it a big bulb that's going to swallow you? I hope you like my new fish who's roaming around in the fish bowl. I hope you like my video too. And if you want to join my journey, please subscribe, like, and share.